CBS Austin spoke to truck drivers who have been driving for years. They say there have been several times where they've almost thrown in the towel and left the industry for good just because of how taxing and exhausting the job can be. How you get tiresome sometimes. You get frustrated, you know, you just, sometimes you want to call it quits, but you just, Jorge Chavez is a truck driver working for a company in El Paso. The cement pump trucks he operates can reach up to 85 feet in length and weigh tens of thousands of pounds. Chavez has been driving for a living for 15 years now, but he says the job doesn't end once you reach your destination. We, we get there and we set up everything for the concrete guys to have the concrete available to them. We have to put pipes and hoses so we could reach the other end of the building. And then as we're coming back, we're taking off pipe and hoses. We wouldn't finish there till like three, four in the afternoon. And then we go back again in at eight o'clock at night. Before CBS Austin obtained court records that showed Hernandez admitted he was on about three hours of sleep and had consumed cocaine the morning of the crash, people were horrified by the video of the crash, questioning whether the driver of the concrete pump truck fell asleep. Sleep deprivation being the possible cause wasn't outside of the realm of possibility for Chavez. It happens all the time. Chavez says the hours a cement pump truck driver works can be brutal. He says some people come in at 8 in the evening and don't get off until 3 or 4 in the afternoon the next day and have several jobs in one day. Chavez says he himself has fallen asleep behind the wheel only to be woken up by the sound of the truck hitting rumble strips on the side of the road. For this reason, he makes sure to train drivers properly. Safety and everybody's got to go home. That's what I tell. Make sure you do your job right. Make sure you get enough sleep. Don't drink during the week. Federal regulations do limit the number of hours a truck driver can work, but concrete pump trucks operating within Texas boundaries are different. There's no limit on the hours those drivers can work. When you're pushing every kind of getting every ounce, if you will, out of that stone um, to try to get maximize your runs and your revenue in a given day, that has a cost that has a cost on your physical health as a driver and it has a cost on the safety of everyone else regardless executive director of the truck safety coalition zach kahalen says truck drivers must be held to a higher standard and be more alert and aware than other drivers if you can't conduct your work in a manner that doesn't put people at risk you got to find a different job the Truck Safety Coalition says it's currently working on a petition to revoke commercial driving privileges from truck drivers if they're at fault in fatal crashes. In Austin, Monique Lopez, CBS Austin News. Thank you for watching. Please hit the subscribe button and get the latest news by downloading the CBS Austin News app.